Hey YouTube, how's it going? I've just got another video here just showing you how to, at this time, assign individual effects to the foot switches on the MIDI device. Now the one I've got here is the Stomp I.O. by IK Multimedia. This has two modes. It lets you select presets and go up and down banks, and also a Stomp mode, which lets you assign effects to individual foot switches. This is, this is what I'm going to cover here in this video, okay. So um, again, as always, just make sure that you've got this um, it can spot your media device so make sure that these are checked those boxes okay and here's how I do it so I'm in stomp mode which is the individual foot switch is turned on and off within the preset okay so the first thing you do is you click on the button that would turn on an effect as you'd imagine enable MIDI learn I'm going to add the um, this first pedal to the first foot switch so it goes grey it's waiting for MIDI learn and then when I hit that foot switch, it turns it on and off. So that one's done, that's good. Uh, the second one is gonna be a phaser to the second foot switch, enable MIDI learn. And that's done. You just need to hit it one or twice usually. And the third one is this one here, a bit of mod. So enable MIDI learn, the third foot switch. And the last one, I'm just gonna use a nice uh, delay. So we're just gonna go to this one here. Just right click there, enable MIDI learn, and that's the fourth foot switch. Okay, so I'm just going to show you each of these now, and I'll just show you the assigns within the MIDI menu. So, our first one is the overdrive, second one's phaser, third one's chorus, and uh, I've just got the delay so you can see that one. There you go, that's the delay on and off there for the fourth foot switch. Let's just have a look at some of the assign uh, mark, you know, markers that are showing on there now. I've done that. Okay, so I think each MIDI controller might have different things on it, but certainly for the Stomp I.O. that I'm using here, you've got CC20, so Continuous Controller, I believe that stands for, 20. So that's for the, don't forget that's in Stomp mode. So that's 20, so that's the first foot switch. 21, don't forget, was the uh, second one. And uh, the chorus was a third one. And then you've got the fourth, it's going like 20, 21, 22, 23. That just shows it what it you know what number it's assigned it to within kind of MIDI messages, okay? But I hope you find this helpful and uh, please hit the subscribe button. There'll be more videos like this coming up for all kinds of different amp sims as well as uh, stuff by this company. So uh, please hit the subscribe button and check out my tone shop as well because I'm starting to add some nice tones as well for these things that you can enjoy. But thank you for listening and take care of yourselves. Bye bye.